Welcome to SPS 2012. What we have here is the FOC sensorless control to show our new technology based on the new TI observer technology. I'm going to start with identifying the motor. We need to identify the motor to get the observer technology to work proper. While we identify the motor, we find the resistance, the inductance and the flux of the PMSM motor. When you identify the motor, you can see up here you have the option of saying, oh, I want to do an ACIM motor, or you want to do a BLDC motor, or a permanent magnet motor. You can do all these three motor types with one board and one controller, but different software. Right now you see that the identification process is running, that is normally taking around two minutes, and when it has identified, you see that the motor is spinning now, so it's going through the identification process. Up here, you see our EVM that we built for the purpose of showing this new technology, where you have the DRV8312 and a Piccolo device showing the demo. Another important fact is also you actually only need to know these four values down here, so the bus voltage, how many watts the motor is, how many RPMs the motors uh, need, and then the pole pairs. With those four information, you can identify your motor. Now you see the identification process is finished, and we can go to a different slide on the, on the GUI we have. Here we do a speed and torque control. So now I run the motor, now it takes a little bit of time to recalibrate the offset of the motor, after, and it's also doing a recalibration of the resistance. And after that, you see that the motor is starting. You see the torque control of the motor, I cannot hold it, it's still turning. For more information, you can go to www.ti.com slash motor.